Eden's Gate. Sepulture. This is my second time in here. The first time did not work. So I'm running it again immediately after the first time for a better run of this. They decided they wanted to taunt and take it over. They can tank. All right, so first thing that you have to pay attention to is this. It's like a normal radial um, AOE. Just move accordingly. It can be this attack, which is gonna target multiple bots on the grid. The grid is a 16 by 16, or 16 total, but um, Four by four. That plays a lot in this fight. And you can move accordingly in this fight. Look at this one. All right, two rocks are gonna fall. One of them is gonna get marked. You want to place rock that is not marked between you and the boss. If you're tanking, try to tank the boss facing away from the party. Okay, Geo Crush. You're gonna jump on one of these platforms. Pay attention to what happens. If he gets arms, then you want to be in the lane in front of him. And then immediately move off of it. If he gets wheels. That's going to be another thing. Going Crusher, we're gonna do that. Tank Buster. It also applies a stack of physical vulnerability up. If fight lasts too long with a single tank, then you will suffer massive damage. So, with those, you're gonna get one that gets very large. Best place to stand is right there at the corner at the intersection between two of the stacks voice of the land is raid wide damage so be ready to heal through that all right we got another geo crush coming now for this one if he goes wheels he'll want to stand at his side like this because you will get knocked back and then you've got this happening. If the fight lasts longer, you'll get him doing that multiple times. But pay attention to everything that's going around. If you are a DPS, there is no reason that you should be knocked off because everything is telegraphed so well in this fight. Crusher, that's going to apply the debuff. Yep, I'm taking more physical vulnerability. Bomb boulders. Alright, this one's going to be different. This one is going to be like the traditional bomb boulders. You want to move accordingly away from the large one. As soon as the first group goes off, move someplace safe. And then avoid the ground explosions as they come up. Voice of the land is going out. Crumbling down is going out. It is the two boulders that will appear, but we also have expanding ground damage. This one. As soon as he starts casting Seismic Wave, move behind the boulder, if your main tank. Do not move behind the boulder until he starts casting. Stone Crusher is going out again. 
massive damage, so pray you don't get hit by it. Got the final Geo Crush going out. Get knocked back. We'll see if he goes wheels or if he goes arms. Going arms, so stand on his lane. Then immediately get off of it. And immediately move away from the landslide that comes out. Because this is what he does if he survives long enough. And then he will start alternating between a pattern that is repeatable. And... That is the fight. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. I hope you found it informative. If you want to see more Final Fantasy XIV videos, please like, follow, and subscribe. The usual YouTube stuff. To catch me live, check out my Twitch. Link in the description. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.